John 2.13 Kai engus ein ta pasca ton judaion, kai anebe eis yurasaluma ha Jesus. Translation, and the Passover of the Jews was near, obviously that means near chronologically, and Jesus went up to Jerusalem. Why, why do you think it describes him as going up rather than going down? Well, of course, he's, right before this, he's in Capernaum, and uh, the elevation of Jerusalem is much higher than Capernaum, and so it's a journey up in elevation. He went up to Jerusalem. That verb, anebe, what is the lexical form of that? Well, that is from anabino. We saw katabino uh, in the previous verse. Anabino means to go up. Katabino need, means to go down. You'll notice this begins with the prepositional prefix ana, which means up. And I've written out the aorist paradigm of it over here. Anabain, anabase, anabay, anabayman, anabeta, anabason. That would just be I went up, you went up, he went up, we went up, y'all went up, they went up. And this form here, notice, is right there. It's a third person singular. So he went up. Who is the he? The he is Jesus, right? Jesus went up to Jerusalem. The full parsing of that would just be a second aorist, active indicative, third person singular. Let's do one other parsing here. How about ain? Hopefully you recognize that as coming from a me. That is the imperfect of a me. Maybe you memorized the paradigm. A main, ace. Ain, ding, 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 ding. There it is right there, right? Amen. I was, you were, he was. It's that third person singular. He was, or in this case, it was, right? The Passover of the Jews was near.